Hello everybody, it's your girl Danny B and I wanted to come to you to give you a review of this new hair that I just installed. It's by L. Rochelle Hair Collection and it's the Kinky Curly. I have an 18 on the top and a 20 on the bottom. And I have a little bit of leave out. Um, I basically did a braid out. My hair is about a 4B-ish kind of. And so this hair is a lot more curlier than my natural hair. So, like I said, I did a braid out and I used some mousse for the braid out. And what I did to make sure that it blend is I made the braids kind of small. Because I, when I did it the first time, I made the braids a little bit too big and it didn't lay as flat. But it just depends on your hair. Some people have to do twist outs. But I personally did a braid out. But before I actually had the hair installed, I um, co-washed it with this Suave Conditioner, oh, sorry I had it upside down, <laughs> Suave Conditioner, you can get it from any local Walgreens, Target, it's like $2, um, I made sure, make sure you get the keratin, they have a couple different kinds, so make sure you get the one with the um, orange writing on it, so I co-washed my hair the night before I had it installed, um, she did have to cut just a little bit to kind of frame it around my face but because I got the two different lengths it actually created its own layers but um, so maybe if your hair is a little shorter you might have to start it up here I didn't want my hair is a little bit shorter in the front but I didn't want to start it at the very top because that just looks kind of weird to me but it just depends on what length you got because I got the longer length if you get like a shorter length and your hair shorter and you start the um, layers up top that might look better um, but also before just to give you some background about what I did to my hair before I um, had it installed I washed and conditioned it and I use the lock method liquid oil and cream um, and I also do a deep condition so after I washed and conditioned it I use my liquid which is the, the L and lock which is I use Giovanni's leave-in and then oil I do a mixture of um, castor oil, coconut oil, and olive oil. And the cream I use is um, Healthy Hair Butter by Carol Star. So I did that. I let that sit out and then I blew my hair out. Not completely straight, but just enough to get it to um, stretch a little bit because I have a lot of shrinkage with my hair. Like I said, my hair is about a 4B. Um, yeah, so this is the hair. Like I said, it's by, oh, I lost my earring. <laughs> it's by um, El Rochelle Hair Collection. And if anyone is interested in buying it, I am going to um, put the information in the description box when I upload the video and I've had it in for about a day it has minimal shedding um, like I said this is kinky curly hair so you are going to experience some type of shedding with the hair because it's kinky hair you have to think about your own hair it's going to shed some but it's been minimal shedding I've had it for a day and also just to let you know to keep the shedding down and to keep it you know looking full and natural you do want to detangle it every morning um, what I used to detangle it this morning was a combination of water, olive oil, and Giovanni's leave-in. And I put it in a spray bottle as a mixture and I kind of just sprayed it and I um, detangled it with a wide tooth comb. So you want to do that every you want to do that every morning when you wake up. You know, you sleep with a bonnet on and you do it every morning. And then, you know, if it gets, you know, a little bit more tangled, then you can use the suave again to bring it back to life. But like I said, I haven't had to do that. I've only had it a day. But I did co-wash it with this before then. So this is a review. Like I said, I really love the hair. It looks really natural. Um, like I said, it's, it, I was able to blend it with my natural hair. And I was worried about that. Excuse my crooked part. Like I said, I don't part very well. Because my hair is, you know, of like a 4B. But yes, I, lo I love the hair and I love the look. So if you have any questions, let me know. Bye, YouTubers.